is Fox 5 News Morning. In our Health Watch this morning, we're learning more about how to prevent running injuries this morning. Sarah joins us now live from the MedStar Clinic in Chevy Chase. Good morning. Good morning, guys. It's how to recover and also possibly prevent injuries as well. We're at MedStar NRH here in Friendship Heights, and I have this lovely little bodysuit on here because I'm going to get into what's called the Alter G here. John Jowers and Megan here are going to help me and show me how this actually works and uh, helps people a lot that are trying to, like we said, prevent injuries or also um, just recover from them. So, guys, how does uh, this is a NASA de developed type technology, and it's fairly new, and not a lot of places have it. So, tell me right. about it. How well, it works. The reason we're zippering you in is because it's going to fill with air, and the way it works is the air bubble that you're zippered into helps de weight your body weight to, by up to 70% of body weight taken off. So, what does that do? How does that help somebody recover, prevent um, any kind of injury or other issue? Well, it makes it so that you can run without as much weight being put through your legs, and therefore not as much wear and tear on your joints or on the tendons in your legs. So, then this way, people can still run and get back to running sooner than expected but without as much risk of re-injury. Okay. So how long would something like this take? You know, does it depend on the injury and the severity of it? It definitely depends, but on average, we can get people back into running after a certain surgery or after a certain injury two weeks earlier than expected. Okay. So kind of show me then how this works. Take me through. Uh, it's a treadmill that's under here, but it's, right. I can be weightless in a sense. And now as it's uh, inflating with air, it's calibrating your body weight. Oh Don't goodness. worry, it's not going to show anything. <laughs> <laughs> so once it's uh, calibrated, then it's gonna. we're going to take some body weight off, and then you can start actually walking and running uh, at that body weight. And I so feel it, it, feels, yeah, yeah. it feels like you're going to be running on the moon. Okay. So now go ahead and start bringing the speed up on the treadmill. Okay. Now, 50%, that means 50% of your body weight is now taken off. I like so that. It, you can it, take 50% off my body weight any time. <laughs> <laughs> So what is it that, um, what kind of deficiencies, like even if you want to prevent an injury, how right. does this help? It, this helps somebody figure out how to run better or yeah, how or, do you do that? Or it allows them to be able to get uh, their running technique back without uh, as much as we had talked about before. Stride deficiencies, things like that, allows them to be able to get that technique back, uh, but slightly sooner. And they can work on it without uh, their knee hurting. For example, if they can't run because their knee's so painful, this is what allows them to run without it hurting. Does that actually then strengthen the other muscles that are around it? Does it help do that? Well, they might have to be doing some homework on their own in the meantime <laughs> to be able to do that. <laughs> okay. So it, explain to me then, um, you know, how long would you be doing something like this on the Alter G? Well, maybe. Or, at a time, any given time. Let's say your typical run was 20 minutes. You could be doing a 20-minute run on here. But then it just means that you're not having to be in pain the whole time that you're on this. How much time would you shave off in recovery, do you think? Oh, uh, if they're really dedicated, I would say for a 5K, if, if you were using this and doing your homework on your own at home, you could be shaving off a, a, a good half minute to a full minute off, you know, a, a 5K distance or a half marathon, shave off a couple of minutes. So it also helps you run faster, quicker. That is if you're in here for performance enhancement, because we're also using this primarily for running injuries. Uh -huh. Folks aren't looking to shave time off their So then for base. injuries, how much time do right. you shave off in recovery versus if you didn't use this? Oh, for things like that, they're they're taken off uh, two weeks earlier. For example, people who come in after an Achilles tear, they can't run for weeks, and now they're coming in two weeks earlier and starting to run that much earlier than expected. It's it's a great ability to be able to wow. do that. A couple weeks. Yeah. Now we were talking about earlier. We had the uh, running assessment. Um, there was a little bit of like a hip drop. You said on me. How would right. you correct that in here? I would cue someone on making sure that their w uh, waistband is as parallel to the ground as possible. So now that you're a little bit de-weighted you can actually focus on that a little bit more. Maybe focus on engaging your abs a little bit more and keeping it parallel to the floor. And there are other locations, just real quick, I know we're out of time, but the other locations where you use this technology, correct? Right. We use we and utilize not just not just the Alter G, but also running assessments at the MedStar NRH locations in Perry Hall and uh, in the Baltimore area at the Harbor Hospital, uh, down here in Friendship Heights, of course, Germantown, uh, and uh, the Boston and McLean locations in Northern Virginia. Okay, John Jowers with MedStar NRH here in Friendship Heights. Thanks so much, and uh, I love how weightless I feel right now. It's a good feeling, guys. Reminds me of being back in a pool, you. that feeling. It must be like that. All right, yeah. Sarah, thank you. <laughs> we'll be right back.